We got the movie night coming up, right? Yeah, we can. Yeah, yeah, everything's set up as far as I know. The last time I checked, it was all set up. So yeah, we just have to. We're gonna have to hang out with Jitsi and watch Tron, and um, we'll have to we'll have to do that more often. Like after after that, because that's that's the birthday movie, and then after that, we'll have to we'll have to do like a movie like you know every once in a while. I think that should be like the the get together of all the people on on minds that you know that have been on the show or that do podcasts or anything like that. Mm-hmm. You can all have a movie night like once a month. We're, we're always talking about movies too, so like you know, like yeah. we'll, we'll always like uh, that's one of our standard like questions answering. We could like always. just have like a list, you know. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So well, just, we always got some topics, you know, to bring like, up. We, we, we got. Movies. Gotta, I, I bring up that one movie that I put on the list, uh, the, cube, the Cube. I have it somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got the Cube. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta make the ma- the, the list out. Of course, all the Matrixes have to be on. The yes. List. <laughs> <laughs> and then, uh, you know, I want at least one Harry Potter movie on the list. Okay. <laughs> and maybe that's like another thing that we do. Like, we'll, we'll have, uh, what's your favorite, like Harry Potter or whatever, and then like, we'll have like a battle to see which one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just like we do with the games, like the uh, yeah, Sonic yeah. vs. Mario. Yeah, right? Sonic. Like, like, yeah. Which one? You have to decide. <laughs> you have to pick on our show. Whose side yeah, are you on? Yeah, Todd or Mario? Evil Mario? <laughs> yeah, evil Mario. Yeah. Oh, um, Michael Studios, um, whatever. He um, recommended a movie that one time. Synchronic or whatever, and it's on Netflix. I watched it the other day. It was pretty oh, crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah but... basically, which is weird. It's supposedly a synthetic uh, DMT that they take into pill, and, and I had problems with that. Like, technically speaking, if it was a synthetic DMT, you would have to like smoke it to like get the effects of it. Okay. <laughs> like, no, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, that unless they have some science that I don't know about. <laughs> but let's 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 put that on the side. But okay, so anyways, there's a synthetic uh, DMT that people are taking, and uh, supposedly, um, if they're young, they have like a more fluid uh, third eye, and they're able to uh, time travel. And then they get they get stuck in time travel, and these kids are disappearing. And then if you're older, you kind of like die because you can't handle it. <laughs> okay. Anyways, so they're they're paramedics, and one of the the one of the guys has like a, a teenage daughter, and she takes it and disappears. And his partner has like this weird, um, I think like this weird thing with his uh, pineal gland that he has like a young one or whatever. I don't know, and that he's able to time travel and to go back, and like he figures this out. So he's like doing it. And everybody thinks he's like spiraling out, and he is kind of spiraling out, but he's actually like taking this drug and like time traveling. <laughs> and that's why he's okay. like, yeah, it's pretty interesting. It's, it's pretty trippy. It's yeah, yeah, yeah. It kind of reminded me of like a uh, Salvia. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Have you ever seen a uh, um, of Mice and Men? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The book's way better, but. Yeah, I like the yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. That, that that puts it everything in like a three sixty spin. <laughs> <laughs> I think if it's anybody, it's not mice, but it's cockroaches that rule the world. By the way, definitely, because they don't die. You can't kill them. Like no matter what you do, there's always going to be cockroaches. <laughs> you know, there's this um, book that I read uh, back with like a college and um by oscar zeta costa and he's the attorney for hunter s thompson so you know like in fear and loathing you have the benicio del toro guy that's his attorney but so his real name is oscar zeta costa and he wrote this book called the revolt of the cockroach people and he was talking about like hispanics and he says that you know they try to like stop us out but like we're, we're, we just they can't kill us and we're everywhere. <laughs> and then it's a 
basically. Okay. <laughs> That's why he used that, that title. The, the Revolt of the Cockroach Roots. This is like during like, you know, like Chicano power in like this in the seventies. It was just kinda of funny. Um, that title. Revolt of the Cockroach oh, Roots. Right. <laughs> I'll have to check that one out. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, that guy's crazy though. Well, you seem fear in love in, in Las Vegas, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. You, you know how like crazy that is. And like that, the book to uh, Revolt of the Cockroach People uh, by Oscar Zeta Costa is just as crazy too. It's like, you know, he's like a lawyer and like these kids get killed by like cops or something. I don't know. He's like, there's some trial and then like he, he goes to court and then like afterwards he goes to bars and like gets into fights and like does other things. <laughs> and, like, <laughs> he ends up like later on, he, it ends with him like escaping to like Mexico in the book and then but in like in real life he goes he goes down to Mexico but he like disappears and like no one knows like really what happened to him like he probably like got killed by a cartel or something I don't know but like, it, like there's like a real mystery of like he just like disappears one day like goes down to Mexico to hide out and like never seen again <laughs> He probably, probably, you know, started his own tobacco farm and is yeah. now making cigars and he's <laughs> doing just fine. Just okay. doing fine. Hanging out on the just beach. <laughs> Mining Bitcoin in some yeah, like, yeah. cartel warehouse. <laughs> Right. Oh, man. I wonder how much Bitcoin the cartel has. <laughs> I bet a lot. 